This video is presented by EA Game Changers and a massive thanks to them for allowing me to take part in an Anthem Early Access Capture event. What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you an Anthem video and today guys I bring you gameplay footage of how you will unlock the Forge crafting side of the game. But before we get into the video guys I am giving away a full copy of Anthem to be in with a chance of winning it simply make sure you're subscribed to this channel, drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. More details in the video description. Now, if you guys have already purchased the game but would still like to show your support, you can by hitting that like button. And if you are new around here and Anthem videos are what you want to see, be sure to subscribe as I have many, many more exclusive videos to come which you will not want to miss. Now, when you get to Fort Tarsus, it's probably a smart idea to search this social space, looking for certain vendors here and there and getting to know them and what they offer. The vendor to unlock crafting is called Prospero or Prospero depending on how you want to pronounce it. When you visit him, he asks you if you will help him relight the forge. For this mission, you are required to go into the bastion and search specific materials. You have to collect three of them. The material is called ember, a natural occurring dangerous byproduct of anthem used as a foundation for human technology. This rare substance can be found by harvesting plants and minerals throughout bastion. So let's get into it. Mission briefing is as follows, freelancers often find extra work doing odd jobs for people in Fort Tarsus. It's also a good opportunity to explore the jungle for extra resources to upgrade javelins, or if it strikes their fancy, go looking for trouble. In this case you need to search outside of the fort to collect Ember for Prospero. This rare substance can be found in plants and minerals. So for this simple mission I decided to try out the Interceptor which I'd played a couple of brief missions with already, loaded up free play and went on the search. In this footage I'm really still getting used to the Interceptor and what it's all about and what it can do in terms of special attacks and so forth. It was also the first time I'd been on the lookout for certain said materials as part of a mission. So it was definitely worth my time learning more about such and learning about the craft rewarded for actually doing this. Now when doing this in free play, there was no mention or indication of where these ember plants were. So I was just running around performing all kinds of flips looking for that trouble. The weapon I was using at this stage, I believe I could only equip one as well, was the Relentless Light Machine Gun. Other gear I was using were the Plasma Stars, common version by the way, powerfully charged throwing stars that march through armor and a Venom Bomb kind of grenade. Thrown Bomb drenches target in acid for 5 seconds. Now this mission was kind of brief and upon collecting three materials needed I was prompted to return to Fort Tarsus and speak with Prospero, which in turn people unlocks the crafting side of the game which can be found within the forge. You will notice now within your loadout section and within the nodes you will see that crafting tab. Crafting and how it works I've already made a video on a complete guide on as well as leveling up and how that's done every detail you need to know and that video can be found on my channel so do check it out people. But yeah guys this is how you initially unlock crafting and should be your first instance of having to collect certain said materials to unlock certain features in the game. Now I know it's kind of clear to everybody that farming materials would be a major part of the game but this mission I believe was the first in which it was actually spoken about so it was definitely worth my time recording, uploading and talking about and especially because it unlocks the crafting side of the forge area which is pretty cool too. A place which you can craft certain components, weapons, whatever. And all these materials you collect add up, not just materials you find within Bastion, but materials for salvaging all the parts you do not need. They all add up for you to create newer, fresher gear. But yeah guys, this is how you initially unlock crafting, and like I said, should be your first instance of having to collect certain materials to unlock certain features in the game. Now if you guys enjoyed the video, leaving a like really does help out. If you are new around here and Anthem is a game you are interested in, make sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But people, I have plenty more exclusive Anthem videos to come, so stay tuned for them. But guys, thanks again for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.